Dr. Sully here, and <clears throat> this concept hasn't been used too much by Air Force uh, in 2023. Uh, has been used in the past when Army, before they went rogue, uh, and Air Force, they've done this as well as you basically you utilize rocket motion to run the trap to the A back. So, what's going to happen is so if you go uh, A trap to the left, the play side A back, or well, in this case, it is the play side A back. Uh, runs rocket motion, so the cadence is down, ready, set, hot. So you typically want him leaving about the R and ready, hammer step, big wide 90 degree step, two 135 degree steps, and then he's at 90 degrees as fast as he can. When he gets about a yard or two outside the tackle, then he can turn it up. It's all eye candy. People are so terrified of the rocket in high school football. And I've run Rocket now for, this will be my 26th year in uh, 2024 that I've taught the Rocket. So here we are. Now, if you run it out of flex or any three-man surface, the receiver is going to veer inside. The tackle is going to veer inside. The guard is down. The center block's back. Now, if possible, you can ace this player, you can double team this player because there's nobody uh, for whom to block back, but you got to be careful with that in case they pop through. The guard is going to open at 90 degrees. He's going to come, he's going to cross over past the guard and he's going to get his helmet to the right, throw his left forearm and trap the first guy from a two tech out. The tackle is going to scoop. So he's got to open flat and basically you have two pullers. He opens flat and he's going to block the spine of the guard with his left hand. So whoever the guard blocks, you're going to get a natural double team. The backside receiver cuts off. What happens from here is the B-back is going to go. He's going to replace the receiver. He's not going to go into the trapper. He's going to replace the receiver. He's going to get vertical. And he is going to block whoever the fold player is. So whoever would fold back inside, he will block that player preferably to the inside. If he has to block the outside peck and run him, whatever. But that's what he would do. The quarterback's going to take the step. He's going to fake the toss. It's an inside handoff to the A-back who's going to then get vertical inside the trap block and score. So then the quarterback from there can certainly carry out the fake. It's not that big of a deal, but it does cause deception to the eyes. That's a trap off the rocket. And coaches, if you want to win more games in 2024, pick up the phone and give me a call. My number's on the thumbnail of this video, and so is my website. The Triple Option Football Academy and Triple Option Football Academy campus will show you how. Go to tripleoptionfootball.com slash testimonials where you can see all the success stories from the camps and the academy. And I want to help you, but it all starts with you helping yourself. Pick up the phone, give me a call. Let me help you get a lot more wins in 2024. I've been helping people for the last 13 years. So here we go. See you in the next video. Talk soon.